thinking we lead with this one. Ease the buyers into the whole concept of the look. So that's it. One conversation and you and Griffin are just over. Yeah, basically, that was it. Um, you know, I think, I don't know, I think going the safe route is not the best idea. Really? Yeah, you know, I think, I think you have to come out guns blazing. I mean, isn't that what Fierce is all about? <laughs> okay, um, this one? Okay, that's better. I like that. I like that. What do you think? I think you're bailing on something worth fighting for. I'm talking about the look. Forget about the look. Listen, take it from someone who's been there. Don't let David get between the two of you. This is not about David. This is nothing... I mean, it's about him a little bit, but... Griffin was the one who decided not to be honest with me. And who put him up to that? Okay, All I'm man. saying is don't jump the gun and punish Griffin for something that may not be his fault. Not his fault? Griffin's been lying again. Because he's a loyal guy. And you know how David plays on loyalty? Master doesn't even begin to cover it. Just give Griffin some time and he'll realize that David is using him, just like he uses everybody else. Okay, I hate, I hate to interrupt, but this presentation is right around the corner, so maybe we could hold off on the personal stuff. Listen, I know this line is very important to you. I get that. And you put your heart and soul into fears. And as your boss, I seriously appreciate it. But sometimes the personal stuff can't take a back seat. Sometimes we have to deal with it. Well, I didn't... Uh... You know what? It's, it's good to put your heart and soul into your work. Whatever. Don't worry about it. If you need me, I'll be in the lounge. Well, she's just going through a rough time. She'll be fine. Where are you going? To see David. At the hospital. He needs to believe I'm having a relapse. Right? This is me. Being convincing. For a plug to pull. I'm sorry to disappoint you. It's only a blood pressure monitor. I'd be lying if I said the thought never crossed my mind. But killing you doesn't work in my favor. Really? And why is that? As much as I hate to admit this, you might be the one person who can keep me alive. The numbness is getting worse. In what respect? Less feeling, more frequent? Both. You know I wouldn't be here if it wasn't scaring the hell out of me. Is that your way of asking for my help? You fixed me the first time. I need you to do it again. And what about Lavery? What about him? Have you told him about these episodes? No. Not yet. You're lying, Greenlee. After that mess with Madison, you wouldn't keep a secret like this from him again. I didn't come here for marriage counseling. Greenlee, wait. You can't blame me for being skeptical. It wasn't too long ago you'd spit on my shadow if it crossed your path. Wouldn't count that out moving forward. I just find it hard to believe that you would keep something this big from Ryan. He's been through so much. First Emma and then the baby. The last thing I want is to cause him more stress. And if I'm acting as your physician? Stress. Not to mention the fact that we don't know what we're dealing with yet. Something is obviously going on with me. But is it temporary? Am I regressing? And if I am, what does that mean? There's no way for me to Paralysis? Know. Worse? I mean, I don't, I don't want to worry Ryan until I know for sure. Right, look, I wish I could ease your mind, but without a proper examination, without tests... Well, you must be able to tell me something. A hunch, maybe? I mean, maybe it's connected to you healing me the first time around. I mean, I was so relieved to be alive, I never even asked any questions, but... Did you save my life knowing that it wouldn't last? Greenlee. Please, David, be straight with me. Am I going to die? You're not going to die. How do you know? Because I won't let you. But you can't tell anyone that I'm helping you. Do you understand? Not your father, not Kendall. 
especially not Ryan. Is that understood? Yes. So, what do we do? Medication, physical therapy? I gotta take you somewhere for treatment. Can't we do it here? It's not the way it works. David. I need my rest. I'll be in touch.